The Sandy Hook Elementary School shooting in Newtown, Connecticut last December sparked a major debate about guns on campus. Following the tragedy, Oregon Representative Dennis Richardson wrote a letter to Southern Oregon school districts asking them to consider overturning gun bans on school property. And what occurred in Connecticut were to incur in my school, I would feel I have blood on my hands for failing to take action that would save the lives of our children. Richardson said if just a small number of teachers at each school properly knew how to use guns, they could easily fight off any threat to the school. If you had somebody armed on the school grounds, there would have been only a few fatalities and then the shooter would have been brought down. On Wednesday, the Eagle Point School District considered allowing teachers to carry weapons on campus. Laura Atwater has several grandchildren in the district and is a former educator. She said if she was still teaching, she would volunteer to protect students with a weapon. I, I think that people do have a responsibility, all of us, every single one of us, to stand up and uh, take care of one another, look after one another. So if that's what it ta would take for me to save students' lives, let's say, um, I'd carry. But when asked how she felt about if her grandchildren's teachers held a gun, well, that was a different story. I suppose it depends upon, you know, who those teachers are, but then how am I to know? It's a conundrum. Sad world. In Eagle Point, Kyle Averman, NBC5 News.